The saying here goes, you'll know the Newfoundlanders in heaven. They'll be the ones who want to go home. And the adage comes to life on Fogo Island, a 90 square mile patchwork of 10 minuscule fishing villages where clapboard houses the color of jelly beans cling to rock 400 million years old. Among its quirks, Newfoundland has its own time zone, half an hour ahead of the mainland. But wander through Fogo Island's villages and you might as well set your watch back to the 18th century. Back then, all you needed to get by here was a pig, a potato patch, and something called a punt. A small wooden fishing boat used in pursuit of North Atlantic cod, the species that once kept this place afloat. Seemingly every structure on the island was built in service of catching and preserving fish, with one gleaming exception, a $40 million luxury inn. Part edge of the earth destination, part economic engine on stilts, the inn is the brainchild of eighth generation Fogo Islander Zita Cobb. And locals gave her a funny look when she first floated the idea. What kind of reaction did that get? Why would anyone come here? We love this place, but it wasn't obvious when, you know, there are fancy places in the world that people go. Our assumption is everybody wants to go where it's warm. Someone suggested to us it looked like a ship. The architecture of the inn was obviously a topic of much conversation. I think about it as a metaphor. It's about people from here and people from away. It's about the future and the past. 